It seems that you have a great vision about the future in technology. How could you define, let's say, three main keywords that will be the targets for the next five years, let's say? Okay. First, uh, first, I think, uh, is the most... Uh, Maybe you've heard it a lot in Dubai, but the thing that we want to do most is that we ha we want to create the the future by connecting the minds from around the world. Um, so this is, I think, uh, this is what we're about. This is what Dubai is about. Has been about for for decades. We have been uh, Dubai has been a trading hub in the past, and this is will continue to be in the future to act as a connecting point for all the different ideas and minds around the world and for us to for Dubai to be a center point for knowledge based economies and to create the future from Dubai by coming to Jitex in the last two months for example there has been a strong push from his highness uh, in terms of technology so um, the first thing is is, is mobile government So in the next coming years, in, uh, in Dubai specifically and UAE uh, in general, you will start seeing more and more uh, mobile applications starting to develop and become a prominent part of daily life in Dubai. So we have a very uh, straightforward directions that this is the, the, what we were to become is for the people in Dubai to conduct their governmental uh, transactions through mobile which is a big push for startups and the application and mobile development industry. The second thing is ICT infrastructure with another announcement that we want to make Dubai a smart, uh, one of the best smart cities globally. You will start seeing um, very strong you know, investi investments made in the ICT infrastructure. So with uh, the recent committee being made with the telecoms, with the major players around the city, Uh, municipalities you know uh, around the city being part of this committee so we expect two things have to happen in the future mainly mobile developments in terms of federal government but also ICT infrastructure in terms of Dubai the best ideas are you know related to the government I think so you will s uh, now you will see uh, things like uh, the uh, housing programs that we have so even for uh, the people for the land departments they just announced so many projects these are these are very important integral integral things for the for the uh, for people who live here i think in dubai but sooner or later you'll start seeing more ideas that affect daily lives for for uh, residents here so ideas i think they will keep coming on ideas in jitex are always announced something new every year and uh, It's very difficult to say which idea is the best, but if you come every year, I'm sure you will notice that uh, so many different announcements uh, to make in Jitex. And, uh, you know, Jitex have been gro has been growing year on year. So you're going to see this. I'm sure you'll see a bigger uh, Jitex event next year and maybe more, ev even more ideas next year. In your country, how much the ICT industry represent? Okay, by the year 2015, the UAE will reach 40 billion dollars in terms of ICT, uh, uh, you know, expenditures. Um, UAE alone, uh, the Middle East in general, has about in the e-commerce industry has about nine billion dollars today, which will reach about 15 billion dollars by 2015. So the growth is huge, and the opportunities are huge, and I think. Uh, Maybe you've read this uh, or not, but Google just announced that the smartphone penetration in the UAE is the highest in the world, over 75%. So and when, we, when I just spoke about mobile government, this is supported by facts such as 75% penetration of smartphone mobiles, the highest globally. And, you know, uh, with this expenditure that we are speaking about, 40 billion and by just, you know, three years down the road, this is a big, big expenditures. And, and the, not just, you see, the UAE is acting as a center point. The fact is the whole Middle East is jumping ahead on this as well. So the e-commerce, you know, jumping from nine to 15 in, in, in three or four years is, is a huge, huge difference. And we want to be the leading role in this. I think the, the directions were very clear since the year 1999 when the Sheikh His Highness announced that this will be a free zone dedicated to the ICT industry yeah Sheikh, Sheikh Mohammed this is this this 
this was very clear that we want Dubai to be this, the location of choice when it comes to knowledge-based industries. That is what essentially TCOM Industries or investment does. We have we are dedicated to five particular industries at the moment. So if you notice, we have the ICT industry, you know, Dubai Internet City and Dubai Outsource Zone. But we also are part of Dubai Media City and uh, Dubai Industrial City in the manufacturing part. So you have education as well part of us. And these are the things that we want to be Dubai to be a very strong with. So we, we have all these different multinational companies located with us, but they're not located with us, you know, uh, because uh, just because we offer these benefits, but because our uh, free zone benefits, I mean, but because there are strong mandates from the Sheikh as well. So they recognize the, the, the state's, you know, objectives in the long term. And they want to be located with us in Dubai because they realize where we're going and where we're headed. In the long term, the, the vision of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed was very clear. It is to make Dubai the location of choice when it comes to knowledge-based industry. And that is why private companies, like you just asked, are, are coming from around the world to be located here. Uh, how can we summarize the secret of Dubai in terms of technology? In terms of technology, I think the secret of Dubai is uh, the, use, the very strong vision of, of uh, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed, who is pushing us day on day to develop this technology in the city. And uh, the secret, uh, you know, is not just to have, uh, uh, you know, the vision, but it's also to have the government to daily developing itself with the private industry. And this is what we do in Dubai to have, to make that vision, you know, uh, true by uh, making the, the governments work very hard in terms of developing itself with the uh, technology with the private industry. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much.